it's taking us back to the entrance well near the entrance so i was just thinking like is it telling us to get out of the forest <laughs> it could be true you know welcome back to the channel welcome back to another video um this is episode three of the random nautica series um this is probably going to be another one where we're exploring during the day and then this goes into night time as it is getting quite late it's three o'clock now um so it's going to be dark in about an hour but yeah we're going to generate some pins and see what happens in this episode so i hope you guys enjoy if you do leave a like comment and subscribe click the bell as well to never miss a video and follow my instagram at explore on road also follow alicia which is alicia underscore obex yep so yeah follow her and let's go let's go and do this the app is open and we're about to generate a location we've put the radius down to two now so it's a bit closer um someone suggested in the comments so we might as well do just like closer stuff see what happens but yeah i've got my intent in my head and oh wait actually we're gonna do some people said to do more voids as well so let's do a void i've got an antenna in my head so let's go and generate a pin wait what no true anomaly available well i guess the radius is too small for that one let's try an attractor this is a fail <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. Do power, do power. No, I think we have to hire the radius. Okay, do it to like, what, two and a half maybe? Alright. Alright. Yeah, okay. Okay, we've increased the radius by 0. 0.5. <laughs> because I can't find anything, so maybe I'm not here thinking hard enough. Let's go and try again. <clears throat> do a void. Okay, got a pin. Horsham Rugby Football Club. Okay. Church. Let's go. Let's go and see what we can find. Right, so we are here now, as you can see. And um, if you're wondering why I've got this pinned as a star, it's because that we actually know this church and it's meant to be haunted. Right, so this would have been a good pin at night, but mm. it's fine. Well, we're here now. Um, I've obviously had an intent, which is nothing. It's nothing scary, though. That's the thing. So, oh yeah, tell them, tell them what you thought earlier. Yes, yeah, so basically, when I drove down the road to find somewhere to park, I just thought, wouldn't it be funny if it brought us to this church? And then if we parked up, we'd done the pin. And like I had my head down and Tom said something about church and I looked up, I was like, church? And I sort of like looked at him, we both just looked at each other and he said which one it was and I was just like, nah. <laughs> it's actually yeah. so scary. But like, we have explored this one at night time before. Yeah, oh crazy. my God, guys. This this one at night, because obviously it has graves all around it. And I, wait, I swear it's like an abandoned one because it hasn't been used in ages. I don't know. Right. The thing is, this this church is very well known to be haunted. Like it's been on TV as well. That's the thing. And there's obviously graves all around it. And there's this part that you walk into the bushes and there's graves inside. And it's just so fucking it's like creepy. A little secret bit, isn't it? Yeah, it's graves. so weird, guys. It's so weird. Like at night, it's so scary. But I mean, we're here during the day. We've got an intent, so let's go and see what we can find. <clears throat> Okay, so we are here. Let's have a look around. And see if we can find anything to do with my intent. Obviously, you guys don't know what it is yet. But this looks so weird though. It's just creepy to be honest. Like, graveyards are creepy anyway. Do you know? <laughs> yeah, yeah, we're definitely going to go there. So what I was thinking of. It's the complete opposite to this location. Because what I was thinking of is literally something happy. People actually come to these graves then. You mean the other part of the world? Well, no, because usually you don't see anything. But these actually do have oh, some fresh the little flowers here. Christmas wreaths down. 
That's so yeah, sweet. Yeah, I guess actually that could be happy. Oh, that's so sweet. But yeah, what we're going to do, guys, is basically that thing we're talking about in the bushes where you walk through and there's more graves inside. I'll go and take you there and you'll see how creepy it actually is. Because I wish it was dark because it would have been worse. But it's still worth to show you guys. So literally, as you can see that hole just through there. It's literally in the bushes. Just gotta walk through into there. Actually, so weird, guys. Look at this. There's actually graves here. That one's like sank into the ground. <laughs> Do you hear that? Mm -hmm. Wait, this is new. No, this one's been here for ages. Yeah, there's always been a massive um, thingy here. Oh. But like as you can see, it's 2019, so obviously it's last year. Okay. So it's fresh. That's actually creepy, man. I mean, it's quite sad as well. Yeah, you've got oh, some... Oh, yeah. Oh, stars. Are they tulips? No. I don't know what they are. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, these these have actually really made me happy. Yeah, I guess it's quite happy because it's around Christmas time, so people come in here and place in these. Like, I feel so cheered up by this. I don't know. Right, guys. So we're gonna generate another pin. It's Alicia's turn. We put the radius up to three. If you can see that. Um, and we're doing a tractor this time. So yeah, let's go and see what we can find. Oh, got a okay. pin. Looks like it's on like a walking trail with the dotted lines. Mm. If it loads, I think the connection is quite bad here to be honest. No, down a very unconnected road. Yeah, kind of out of nowhere. Okay. It's kind of loading. <laughs> <laughs> oh. But it's doable because there's a that, that dotted line, if you guys can see that, it means it's a walking path, which means it's definitely accessible. And that looks like quite an interesting location to be honest. Okay, so basically we have to park where we are right now because there's a gate to go down this road. But it's a public footpath, so what we're gonna have to do is just walk down it. The thing is it's a three minute drive, it says. So it might be a bit of a long walk. Oh, three minute drive? Yeah. I thought it was a three minute walk. No, nah, three minute drive. Okay. Um, so yeah, I guess I will update you guys when we're about to get to the location. So yeah, see you guys there. Okay, so the pin is just in front of us over there, near them bushes, just somewhere in that area. But this is actually a cow field. So muddy here. But it's unfortunately there's no cows. Would've been quite nice to see cows. <laughs> but yeah, let's go over there. Oh my god, no. We always end up in these fields. Just look out for the big poops. Oh, I'm not stepping in that. Oh yeah, also guys, if you've seen episode two, um, Random Nautica episode two, I'll link it up here if you haven't. So click on it after this video and make sure to give it a watch. Basically, we found an abandoned house um well what we believe to be an abandoned house and we said we're going to go back during the day um, and we did today earlier but we couldn't actually we got in but we only got into a little bit of the house because we couldn't go any further because all the doors were closed unfortunately but it was literally full of stuff untouched so obviously i videoed the place because i thought i was going to explore explore the whole house um but i couldn't as the doors were closed uh, so it was only a four minute video, which is pointless for me to post. And also I did take some pictures, but I'm not going to post them either because it's just not really worth it. But yeah, just wanted to give you an update on that house like I did I will. Like I did I will. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Mate, I can't speak English. 
but yeah i just wanted to give you an update guys um on the house um and yeah that's it really <laughs> but yeah it was literally untouched with everything left behind but we couldn't really explore it so a bit shit but we live we live on anyway let's go and what did you say did you move <laughs> 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 right guys let's um see what the what the pin is we actually kept like wa i kept walking and talking <laughs> what the fuck man I kept walk yeah i kept walking and talking and literally the pin is just like right in front of us now it's just over there um so alicia might as well reveal the intention spotlight on me now yep spotlight on you there you go <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? Okay, no, it's something spiritual. But something spiritual? Yeah, I think it's something That's spiritual. That's actually a good intent. Yeah, I, I like that one. Mm hmm Oi, you know what spiritual could be? What? Cows? The spiritual animals. Are they really? Well everything is spiritual to be honest. In a way, yeah. I think. Yeah. Like but, I was even thinking <clears> just <throat> being on like oh for the people ruined it now. But <laughs> When it was empty, I felt nice and free. There you go, guys. Something spiritual. Quite impressed with that. <laughs> Pretty good intent there. Thank you very much. Um, but yeah, we are trying to do intents that you guys suggested in the last video. Yeah. I mean, that wasn't one. It actually came from Alicia. So. <laughs> but the first one I did was obviously something positive, something happy. So that was one of the ones that you did. Uh, suggest in the comments so i'll probably do another one from the comments just in a second but we need to walk back and get back to the car so yeah i'll see you guys in the car radius four kilometers we adjusted it to have a higher radius a larger radius so yeah let's see what we can generate what can we do actually should we do quantum yeah no actually i'm gonna do void <clears throat> okay. Let's just avoid. Just stick to the general ones. Right, let's generate. Well, got a pin. Let's see where it is. I'll just hit the middle of the field. It is not. Oh, oh it's someone's house. Oh. Oh, <laughs> the thing is, guys, this could actually be connected to what my intent is. But even though it is, it could be, there is obviously no way of us going into a property that is not abandoned, <laughs> that's actually lived in. So what do we do? We could easily go there, but. It's oh. also like right on the house. Yes, the house. It's not... literally the house. I, I think let's go. Let's go. Guys, I'm going to... Yeah, let's just go. Basically, guys, let's just go and do it. Because my intent could be there. But if it's, if it's nothing... If nothing's there, we're going to generate another pin. But I actually kind of do want to check this one out. We're not going to actually go into the house, obviously. <laughs> but we're going to go next to the house. Just have a look and see if there's anything around. Okay guys, so we're here now, but obviously the house is just down there. Um, I'm not gonna go over there because people will think I'm weirdo. I'm a weirdo. <laughs> um, so basically what my intent was, um, is something violent. I know it's a bit of a dark intent, but why I wanted to come here is obviously we could have heard like people arguing in there or something to do with violence. Um, but, Obviously, I can't go in the house. I can't go anywhere near the house because it's a bit dodgy. Like, you think I'm some sort of weirdo. Um, but yeah, I think we're just going to do one more pin um, and try and see what we can find. Right, so basically, guys, we're going to do something different to make this more interesting. Um, we're going to be going to a haunted forest. <laughs> um, it's really dark now. It's actually pitch black. So it should be scary. Um, but what we're going to do is we're going to go inside it in uh, pretty much in the middle of it and then generate a pin in that area and see. Obviously, the intent 
we're going to do is something to do with haunted things to obviously like match the haunted theme of the forest but yeah um we're going to go there and then start generating pins it looks so dark over there we're currently walking over a bridge to get to the actual the actual forest just gonna go try and go a little bit deep into the forest and see if we can generate any locations to go left or right well that's an actual path we might as well go this way and go into the forest this track path but yeah see you guys in a bit when we're gonna be generating the pins all right let's try um quantum blind spots and see well, let me lower that down to one kilometer and see if we can get anything oh oh yeah let's go we're gonna have to go back because we went past that pond i think guys so i just realized that um it's not actually taking us to that turn where we thought it did. It's taking us all the way back to the entrance. So we made an effort to obviously go in the middle of it to try and get the radius and actually generate something in the forest. But it's taking us back to the entrance, well, near the entrance. So I was just thinking like, is it telling us to get out of the forest? <laughs> it could be true, you know. Wait, what's that noise? Oh no, it's fine. <laughs> but yeah, um, we're, three minutes away so yeah i'll see you guys when we are near the pier i think someone's fishing oh interesting might be ruining me for the rest of my life oh yeah maybe mm, a bit misty oh. Definitely hear something going on there. Yeah, I'm going to tell you guys what I'm thinking of already because we're pretty much at it and it could be anywhere around here. So basically what I was thinking of, obviously it has to be something to do with haunted. So what I said, what I thought of is just something scary really, to be honest. So have a look around. Like if you guys see anything, then put it down in the comments if I miss it. But it's just meant to be something scary. I mean, to be honest, it's already scary just being in this haunted forest. Just us two. Yeah. What? Wait, what? Where is she going? Oh, no. <laughs> Can't see anything. That's disgusting. That's really gross. This is the exact pin, though. Well, I mean, that's kind of weird and spooky. Maybe that tree with the three fingers. <laughs> three fingers, four fingers. It actually looks like a like long fingers. Like, like. Wait, can can I see that? No, not really. No, come a bit closer. That's it. Yeah, a bit. Uh, can you see that, guys? <laughs> like these long. To be honest, it looks better in real life. But it's just like, these long fingers coming out the ground. <laughs> so weird. I mean, the pin was right here next to this tree. So I'm just trying to have a look. Is there anything weird about this tree? Anything scary? To be honest, anything, anything looks scary. In pitch black in the middle of the forest. Hey, right, Alicia, come here. <laughs> Look in the camera. Come here. What does it look like? <laughs> what does it look like? Am I really supposed to answer that? <laughs> <laughs> On camera? Nah, I think everyone knows to be honest. It looks so much better on camera as well. <laughs> it actually does. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Well, that's de that's definitely not scary, unless... <laughs> do you find that scary, Alicia? No. <laughs> yeah, the thing is, guys, um, we did this pin, because we literally... That, that idea just clicked into our head. To go in the dark, in the middle of the forest, 
and generate pins, like play around the nautical. So what we're gonna do is, there's someone coming. So what we're gonna do is make a whole episode out of it basically and just generate pins in the middle of the forest. So we're gonna do it at like midnight. So it's pitch black. Well, I mean, it's pitch black now, but midnight is obviously like the hour that you should kind of do haunted stuff in. It's like midnight, one o'clock. Um, so yeah, we're gonna come here, or maybe we might find some different ones, but I don't know. But yeah, pretty much the next episode is gonna be about doing pins in a haunted forest. I think it's just quite unique. It could be a good test. So I hope you guys actually like that idea. <clears throat> um, but this is it for this episode, I think. We're gonna head home now. And yeah, we'll see you guys back in the car. Okay guys, so this is the end of episode three. Um, we made it a bit more interesting towards the end, going into that forest and generating a pin. Um, we are going to do a whole episode, like I said, about generating pins in a haunted forest. So that should be pretty interesting. See what happens. So definitely stay tuned for episode three, four, four, four. <laughs> episode four. Um, and yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Please leave a like, comment and subscribe. Also click the bell as well to never miss a video and follow my Instagram at Explorer on Road. And also follow Alicia, which is Alicia underscore Urbex on Instagram. So yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video.